Hey guys, welcome back to Free Car Repair. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video to any of you guys having a Toyota camera. We're talking about this generation here from year 2012 to year 2014. If you guys have one of those and if you have a problem where the car does not lock or unlock, stay with us. We'll explain which fuse relay you need to check for the central locking, where you can buy cheap fuses and relays. That way you do not waste your money and why it's important to test fuses and relays. All that guys will be covered absolutely free for your convenience. Make sure it's stand till the end. So before we start, let us tell you a little bit about us guys. We'll be making a video for every single fuse, every single relay in that generation to your Camry and every car we get at the garage. Why we do that? Because many of you will need that information sooner or later. Let's say you need a fuel pump guys, fuse, or we need a steering angle sensor. Those will not be labeled correctly. You will have abbreviations that might say something like FI. You may not have an idea that's a fuel pump guys or fuel injection system. So that's why we're making video for every single fuse, every single relay to save you time and money. And if you're stuck in the middle of nowhere, or if you need to find a fuse, all we have to do, spend a minute or two, watch the video, find out the fuse, instead of guys spending uh, time to find it in the, in the service manual, instead of guys wasting money, okay, and time on parts and tools you don't need. Another thing guys, Every single car we get here at the garage, we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. Those are our main YouTube channels. We have more than 1.2 million subscribers, guys, and we have more than 10,000 free repair videos that can save you thousands of dollars in free repairs. Another thing, let us show you something quick. You have, guys, some special fuses and relays. We're going to put a link in the description of the video below where you can get uh, fuses relays at a good price, quick shipping, that way you don't waste your money. You have those multi box fuses, we'll put the link for them as well, for different fuses, for different relays, okay? Uh, all kinds of fuses and relays, if you need to buy some and not to waste your money, we'll put the link in the description of the video below where you can get them from. Check it out. So, let's start on it now. So now guys, let's explain about the central locking fuse relays. So if you have a problem where the Toyota camera does not lock, we will explain that in this video today or it doesn't unlock. Uh, you have two different fuse boxes, we'll be working in both of them today. We'll start with the fuse box that's on the inside and if you come to the driver's side here and look above the pedals under the dash all the way in the corner on the left side, you will see one white cover, open it and you'll see a fuse box layout that will look just like this one here. Before we guys continue, let's explain quickly why it's important to test fuses and relays. So let me explain why it's super important guys to test fuses. Fuses, not often you can see if they're burned or they're good. Sometimes they may seem perfectly fine, you think it's a good fuse, you put it back in and you end up uh, spending money and time on parts and problems that uh, do not exist guys, when all you have to do, test your fuse, find out it's bad, replace it, fix your problem. So we will have a video how to test a fuse, okay, different kinds of fuses and how to test relays guys. We're going to put the link in the description of the video below specifically to that video please check it out here guys we'll need to check one fuse guys specifically for the central locking if you come in that row of fuses you have fuse number 25 6 7 8 9 fuse number 29 that 20m fuse is the one that you will need to check now about the central locking relay guys now there is very limited information but if you open the hood guys that's your engine car battery that's the fuse box here open that cover you see that fuse box layout here. Now, there, uh, there is very limited information. People don't know where the relay is practically, but we'll tell you where it should be located based on our experience. You have only five relays, none of those is for central locking. But you have that big computerized relay that's known as integration relay. It uh, does multiple things. And in our, okay, uh, uh, in our case, I think, the center locking relay is part of this one or the other thing guys it's part of the bcm this is the body control module this is practically the computer behind that fuse box guys if you look behind that fuse box that computer that's the one right there uh, hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching see you next time